What's going on guys? How y'all doing tonight? Christian Vlogger here and welcome to the WWE No Mercy uh review right here on the channel. We're gonna do a review on No Mercy tonight. If y'all didn't watch No Mercy like I did. Y'all missed a pretty good show tonight. Live on the WWE Network. Forget football. Let's talk about No Mercy. Oh yeah, a little bit of about football, kind of boycotting football because of the protest they're doing against the national anthem. I don't think it's really right of what they're doing, but let's get into the review. Uh, WWE No Mercy 2017. Uh, the the show started off with the uh, Miz coming out first, and then Jason Jordan. Jason Jordan goes for a spear, the quarter, but the Miz boos in context with the shoulder first. Then he drags him to the corner, a huge belly to belly, suplexed by Jason Jordan. And then the referee, uh, the ref, Jordan rolls up the Miz, but the ref was distracted. Miz pushed the Miz is pushed off by a big right head from Ax, Axel that connects. The Miz connects with the C, the SFC, it pins Jordan. One, two, three. The, the Miz. Winner and still Intercontinental Champion of the Miz as he retains over Jason Jordan tonight at No Mercy. Uh, Renee Young is in the ring following the match. Jason Jordan says he's disappointed. He's disappointed he couldn't overcome the odds with the Miz cross, but he still uh, reacted to the Miz a, uh, a quick. Frank Lickley, he loved to his ever have a rematch but the crowd don't really seem to care um jordan says it's funny that the people chant you suck as kurt angle because me this really does suck and the crowd hated that promo tonight guys i don't know if y'all saw that i'm not i paid attention to that next we get a video package detailing the history of bray wyatt Finn balor and a persona challenged Finn Balor to a match without, without the face paint. Uh, there was a quickly of five flies to that. Cell phones lit up in the arena. And Bray Wyatt makes his way down to the aisle. Next out is Finn Balor. He is very popular in Los Angeles. As he gets a huge reaction on his way down the ring. Singles match. Finn Balor versus Bray Wyatt. Uh, this, this one didn't really go... Uh, this one went really back and forth, but finally, um, Finn Balor, Finn Balor backs and charges into a huge drop kick to the chest that launches Bray Wyatt into the barricade. Uh, we'll see, um, back, so start starts to fight back, back, but Bray Wyatt drops him down and sends him crashing down the shoulder first. Um, Finn Balor was able to rally back and beat Bray Wyatt. Um, sitting on the rope. Uh, about Finn Balor was able to hit hit the coup de grace finally on Bray Wyatt, and it's time enough to keep Bray Wyatt down for the three count. Winner Finn Balor defeated Bray Wyatt tonight. Viva the little coup de grace tonight. Finn Balor was able to prove that he could win without the face paint. Finn Balor defeats Bray Wyatt. The coup de grace by Viva the coup de grace. One two three. We get a pretty uh, hyped up, hyped up video for Oscar's debut at TLC. They did a great job of making Oscar look like a big deal tonight. I don't know if y'all saw that promo for Oscar. Oscar is debuting at TLC next month. They did a great job with that promo. Uh, the bar is shown backstage with Charlie and Sheamus interviewed. Talk about Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins tonight. They said we go over there to beat the bar. We keep the bar. Blah blah blah. Seamus Cesaro is out first. The team immediately on the curb. Uh, tag team uh, WWE Raw Tag Team Championship match. Seamus, Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose defending against Seamus and Cesaro. The bell quickly rings. Seeing uh, quick action between them. We're seeing uh, Cesaro busted open, busted teeth. Uh, looked like he had a missing tooth or something. Cesaro brings it to Seamus uh, quickly for a hot tag. Sorry, so bark over arm, uh, Airbus's arm, slamming it into the mat until the referee checks on Dean. 
And we see Ambrose's arm. It says ripping the at the his face, measuring Ambrose was able to his feet. It's Cesaro back to tag to Sheamus. Double uh, double close line. Sheamus kicks Dean Ambrose into the arm lock, but arm but he fights up shoulder shoulder Sheamus. Then is able to drive his knee into Ambrose's gut. And back to him, Cesaro, we'll see, blah, 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 let's, get, let's skip all that. Let's look at all that, because I don't have a whole lot of time. Um, cross face, we get a cross face in the match. We get Everett still able to kick out. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Um, dirty Deeds, we're seeing that at, at the end of the match, we see... Uh, Sheamus and then Ambrose connects with the Dirty Deeds to put Sheamus down for the three count. One, two, three. Winner and still Raw Tag Team Champion Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose retained over Sheamus and Cesaro. Over Sheamus and Cesaro. I'm hearing that uh, there's going to be a Shield reunion. Uh, I don't know if y'all read about that. There's a report out. There's a report out that Sheamus and Cesaro. Uh, I mean, not Seamus Cesaro, but Seth Rollins, Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins, Dean Ambrose, and Roman Reigns will be reuniting for a full Shield reunion to sell tickets uh, at TLC. So we'll see, we'll see the full Shield reunion at TLC with Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, and Seth Rollins finally reunited at TLC next month. That's huge. Then we got Oscar debuting at TLC. Huge stuff going on. Um... Um, next match, we're going to go to uh, a couple of commercials and promos for Connor Cure. We get uh, Showcase Alexa Bliss. Uh, Bliss. Uh, la, 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 la. WWE Raw Women's Championship. Uh, five way match. Alexa Bliss versus Sasha Bates versus Dia Jax versus Eva versus Bailey. Of course, you know who won this match. So let's not even waste any time. Here tonight, we're seeing back and forth between the women, but in the end, in the end, um, in the end, Alexa Bliss tosses Sasha Banks from the ring. Uh, Plasters Viva DDT puts that her down for the three count winner and winner and still WWE Women's Champion Raw Women's Champion Alexa Bliss walks out victorious or still. Women's champion. I have I had five I had five predictions that I got right. Uh five of my predictions were right tonight on T uh, uh the No Mercy. Uh we get a Manan Young with his Alexa Bliss right up the rap. She says there's a lot of stars in Hollywood and superstars in WWE, but there's only one true goddess, and that is the raw women's champion Alexa Bliss. Quote up quote Alexa Bliss. Got a few more commercials. Hype up Roman Reigns and Cena. A bit of delay with Roman Reigns is out. Out next, and then John Cena. John Cena out first with Roman Reigns. Bell Reigns. We got full headlock pushes off Roman Reigns. Uh, Cena jumps up, jumps right back up, uh, up smiling. Cena then tosses, teases to leave the match. Reigns chases it down the ramp, brings it back into the ring. Get it. Uh, seeing rain, rain, rains crashing into the steps. Rain is quickly up and then turns to the favor by launching Cena into another a set of rig of steps. Then he drops Cena into the puts him Cena down to the floor. Rollins and Cena, I mean Reigns and Cena, then back up. He said, "Put said Cena but to the rave with the two cap." Cena then for his head retreats. Process Cena blocks then right hand. Uh, five knuckle shuffle, but Reigns drops with a Samoan drop. Uh, Raw, Roman Reigns crawls towards the rope. Cena realizes it and then drags him back down the middle rope. He picks him up, sit out, power ball for a two count. Reigns and then Cena pull each other. Others up trade right hands. Reigns kicks Cena in the gut. Cena still able to. Roman Reigns tie up with a cross face, flips him on the shoulders, AA, but he was able to keep Roman down for the three, three count. There's a lot of cloak cheering here. Uh, each one. Of 
Second AA in a row, but Roman Reigns was able to kick out. Reigns hits the two in the air and then sucker punches out of the stable center as everyone is in shock. Cena stands and eats a Superman punch, falling a spear, and Roman Reigns gets a three cap. Roman Reigns, your winner, defeats John Cena. I think, really truthfully, Cena put Reigns over tonight. And uh, after the match, we see sportsmanship, we see Raids, uh, John Cena raids Roman Reigns' hand and Ra Roman Reigns' hand in victory. And then uh, John Cena sets up the Raids and then Cena leaves. I mean, then Cena stays in the ring and Roman leaves. Uh, but uh, truthfully, Roman Reigns did get put over tonight by John Cena tonight. I don't know if y'all saw that, but I believe that's what happened. Uh, WWE Cruiserweight Championship match. Let's move it forward. Uh, WWE Cruiserweight Championship match. Enzo Amore. Let's just face facts. Enzo Amore was able to pull out a victory tonight. We see Enzo blows Neville while the ref low blow to Neville while the referee is putting the belt away. Enzo pins Neville and gets the three count. Winner a dude. WWE Cruiserweight Champion. Neville, which I'm sure probably I'm sure Neville's gonna insert his rematch clause for the Cruiserweight Championship. I'm sure. At the commercial we see Corey Gray distracted. It's gone over Enzo Amore winning the Cruiserweight Championship with a video package versus Lexner versus Strobid tonight. Uh, Brock better uh, Universal Championship back. Brock Lesnar versus Brock Strobid. The bell rigs. It changes, but only uh, but to be thrown right back in the ring by Lesnar. Strowman, Lesnar, take down. Uh, Strowman kicks. Uh, Strowman picks up Lesnar. And we still throw him aside. Lesnar then connects with a German suplex. Strowman pops right back up. A choke slab to Lesnar. Lesnar. And then him, then a running power slam. Slam, but Lesnar was able to kick out for a two count. Lesnar, uh, Strowman slam, uh, slams Lesnar to quarter. But lifting him uh, with a clubbing blow access to the back. Strowman to the barricade, shoulder first. Headbutt, Lesnar. In the face, Les then seeing Lesnar drops him and hit Strowman hits him in the ropes, knee in the Brock's back. Follow up with the floor, he picks up Lesnar, slamming him, spy first into the post. Ring post. Strowman connects with the uh, locks in the Kumara, even even enough Strowman reportedly able to grab the ropes. Ref colors a call for a break. Strowman fades, falling slowly to the mat. Strowman grabs the ring ropes. The ref forces the break. Both men are men are up. Strowman connects with a flying buster. But in the end, uh, see so Brandon power slam allows Leather to connect for the two at uh, the two count. Um, Lesnar. Shoulders, Braun Strowman with the F5 pinning Strowman and getting the three count and retaining the WWE Universal Championship winner and still Universal Champion Brock Lesnar. Um, Lesnar then throws the title over to over his shoulders and walks to the back exhausted while Strowman recovers on the floor and the show ends with Brock Lesnar walking up the ramp and Heyman looking relieved. But what is going to happen now? What is going to happen now with Strowman now that he lost? What is going to happen now? Where is Brock Lesnar going to do? Brock Lesnar take a tie off for Buddy that... Is Brock Lesnar taking time off? What's going to happen? But uh, I don't know if Lesnar is going to be at Raw tomorrow. I don't know what's going to happen at Raw tomorrow following the events of tonight. But but I do know... Um, I do know we're going to see a Shield reunion at TLC next month. And we're going to see Oscar debuting at TLC. That's Raw's next pay-per-view is TLC. But uh, don't forget, we got WWE SmackDown, No Mercy. We got the final SmackDown on Tuesday, I believe. And then we got No Mercy on the 8th of next month, October the 8th. But that is my official WWE No Mercy uh, review for uh, No Mercy tonight. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel at Chris Vlog.